Tonight, the Raleigh Police Department is pleading for help. They hit the streets tonight to find the driver who hit a 12-year-old girl and just kept going. Yeah, this happened six months ago on Hillsborough Street. That young girl sadly died. CBS 17's Harrison Grubb is live there on Hillsborough Forest tonight. And Harrison, I know the police want to solve this case. What are they doing to try to find this driver? Yeah, well, earlier this evening, they actually were blocking off part of Hillsborough Street, passing out flyers to roughly 400 drivers, all in an effort to identify the driver who struck and killed young Samantha Briggs. Officers slowing down traffic along Hillsborough Street, giving drivers more information about the car that hit and killed young Samantha Briggs. We're hoping that this information checkpoint will help people who drive this road recall any information, any information at all. On November 25th, Briggs was out celebrating her 12th birthday with friends. The birthday celebrations transformed in an instant when she was hit trying to cross Hillsborough Street near Bashford Road around 730. The driver, who RPD says was in a white Honda Civic, never stopped. You might not have known that you struck a child. You might have thought that you struck an animal or an object in the road. It was a dark road. It was a dark night. You might not have known, but it's time for you to come forward. This is the second time officers have passed out flyers in the area. The first effort back in December was in the afternoon, but Raleigh police wanted to do this checkpoint around the same time the hit and run happened. We know that people oftentimes take the same road at the same time. Briggs was one of 27 pedestrians killed in Raleigh last year, according to police statistics. RPD says they've received many tips from the community, but to this point, no information has led to an arrest. But they're hopeful this effort can finally bring justice and closure to Briggs' family. This little girl should have been heading home, getting ready for for Thanksgiving, ready, getting ready for Christmas. Now, anyone with information that can help lead to this arrest is asked to contact either Raleigh Police or Crime Stoppers. Police are also offering a reward up to $5,000 for any information that can help lead to this arrest. Live in Raleigh, Harrison Grubb, CBS 17 News. All right, Harrison, thank you.